All right, coming from uh, by the pond today, I wanted to talk to you guys about something that you may or may not have seen and may or may not have known, and that is talking about turtles scute shedding. Uh, I got right here a cooter that is going through the shedding process, and as you can see, uh, it's got like a lot of shedding going on. So this is a process that many basking turtle species go through um, as part of both growing and as part of a seasonal process. Now my turtles are housed outdoors, so every time they come up from being under for the winter, uh, one of the first things they do is start basking a lot and they're gonna start shedding these scutes like this. Uh, it doesn't hurt them. They don't even feel it, to be honest. Um, and it just kind of naturally, you know, like this one, as you can see, kind of just starts to peel off. Uh, they're made of keratin, which is the same material as your fingernails. And underneath each shedding skewt, uh, you'll see that there's, you know, a new skewt under it and uh, a lot more pigment and stuff coming through. Similar to like when a snake sheds its skin, uh, the colors underneath are going to be brighter and more vibrant. And some turtles do this multiple times a year. Uh, turtles that are growing quickly will shed scutes more often than turtles that are growing slowly. And some turtles shed scutes, some turtles don't. Your basking species, your sliders, cooters, painted turtles, map turtles, uh, pretty much all turtles that bask are going to shed scutes. Now your snapping turtles, mud turtles, musk turtles, they don't shed scutes. Uh, some common snappers will get a little peely when they're growing and uh, shed off a first layer, but those turtles shouldn't be shedding scutes. Uh, their scutes actually just kind of grow as the shell grows. Uh, a lot of things that can make those turtles shed would be uh, inappropriate water quality and uh, poor diet. Now when if you do have a turtle, let's say you have a pet red-eared slider or a yellow-bellied slider and it is shedding scutes. Um, I I tend to not recommend uh, peeling the scute off yourself uh, just to kind of let it come off on its own. It will come off on its own. If you peel it before it's ready, um, it it does seem to irritate them. They, they definitely don't seem to enjoy it. Uh, sometimes you may see your turtle rubbing against uh, objects in the aquarium or pond that you have it in and that's another way that they'll help get those scutes off. A proper diet uh, it seems that vitamin E is important in their diet to help with scute shedding and you'll see that in a lot of uh, quality turtle diets. You'll see that there's going to be some vitamin E in there and some wheat germ um, as well as a natural diet. I mean my turtles are eating pretty much everything they would eat in the wild so uh, they tend to shed scutes pretty easily. So yeah, that's scute shedding. Alright, so I hope this helped you learn a little bit more about scute shedding and why turtles shed scutes. Shed scutes. A little bit of a tongue twister there. So yeah, hopefully this was uh, helpful information for you and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Feel free, or to, feel free to share this video, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks.